One of the most common malocclusions observed in orthodontic relapse cases is when the lower anterior teeth are crowded, tipped lingually, and super erupted. This creates a very deep bite. When the lower arch is viewed from the side, it can be noted that the lower plane of occlusion is not flat, but rather curved, also known as a steep curve of spee. When this is observed, an immediate consideration is to flatten the curve of spee by intruding the lower anterior teeth. This will also help to correct the deep bite. When this is done, there will be room created between the labial surfaces of the lower incisors and the lingual of the upper. This space can be used to aid in unraveling of the lower crowded teeth, reducing the need for excessive interproximal reduction. So, when evaluating patients with lower crowding, be sure to first check to see if they have a deep bite accompanied by a steep curve of speed. This can actually be to your benefit in obtaining an ideal final result.